one Zoomers virtual RV show. This is a very popular model last year. It's a 2021 Jayco 29.5 PHO pad. Its regular scamper is as less than 10,000 pounds, as two slides, and sleeps 10 people. So if you're looking for a fifth wheel, you need more space, but you also have a lot of people to sleep. This really is a great option for you and some great Funcast features. I think you'll really like the inside. This is a Cantus fiberglass cap right here. You'll notice the beautiful LED accent lighting. We have our spare tire mounted underneath. Always good to have with you on the road. And this pass through storage here. You'll notice that there is TV hookup. And of course, Jayco's are a great product. You don't forget about the aluminum frame, vacuum, bond, lamination. Jayco's are meant to last. They're built very, very well. And they actually have very good warranties, manufacturer warranties, compared to other brands. This is a single entrance camper. So notice we have an awning above our head. It's a nice big awning if you have a lot of people, big family. You want to get everyone underneath at the same time. There's an LED light strip underneath the awning. We are wired for solar, climate shield, all for weather protection, so keep your camping seasons long. Make more memories than you would otherwise. Let's look at this outdoor kitchen. This is a very big outdoor kitchen. So earlier I showed you the Colgate TV hookup. We also have a TV hookup here as well. You have outlets for your TV and outlets over here. Up top, you'll notice there's LED light, LED light accents. We have some overhead cabinetry. This is a plumbed sink, so water runs through. You don't have to dump the bowl. It's very tall, our vision refrigerator. Plenty of drinks and storage for the whole family. You have some storage here. And, of course, you can't forget about your grill. This is a very family friendly camper. It has a lot of amenities. Your family or just you and some loved ones will have a great time camping in this fifth wheel. Let's go ahead and take a look inside. Here we're inside this vehicle 29.5 BHOK. So you want to know how we sleep 10 people? Well, this is how we do it. First, we have our hide bed here. You pull this out, it sleeps two people. Yeah, I'll go ahead and show you real quick while we're here. It's very simple, not heavy at all. This place flush. So if you can lounge while you're watching TV, you can certainly do that. That also leaves up your dinette. But, I mean, maybe you want the couch. That was just that quick, up and down. This tight neck also comes down to make a sleeping area. Pictures online at zoomersrv.com. So already you have places to sleep three, four people, depending on the size of the children. We have a four-door refrigerator. As you can see, this is just a massive amount of space. Nice L-shaped kitchen, lots and lots of surface area to work on. This glass cover goes flush with the surface tap, so you have even more room to work. Or we'll flip it up. Three burner furin cooktop and oven. Of course, you have a furin microwave. Overhead cabinetry all the way around. Two basin sink. Wooden cutting board and drying rack. Let's go ahead and take a look at the entertainment. Above our TV, we have storage. So you can have games, books, or movies, anything you want to go up here. We have our TV, 30 inch Furion fireplace. 
a nice big picture. And if you don't want to use this as a planter, you can put these shelves up and use it as a coat rack. Now let's go ahead and look at the bunkhouse. Like I told you, it's a bit unique. So this is actually a quad bunkhouse, but it's not the quad bunkhouse we're used to. So we have one, two, three bunks on this side. We have one, two outlets here. So that everyone have access to at least one port. On the other side, we have another bunk with another outlet. And people always ask us about the weight capacities of the bunks. Kids get bigger, sometimes you have adults staying with you. And here, Jacob puts it really nice. So a single bunk, which this is a single bunk, has a max capacity of 300 pounds, and then the double wide bunks at a max capacity of 600. Right now, all four of these are singles. And of course, this one's on the ground, so you don't really have to worry so much about weight capacity. Here we have three steps. Jacob does not like to waste space, so each step has a drawer. And don't forget about the TV hookup and TV back right there. So this right here will sleep for people. It provides entertainment. It actually has lots of storage built in everywhere you look. So this is a very useful bunkhouse. Keep in mind this bunkhouse is less than 10,000 pounds, so you can have a lot of people not necessarily towing a whole lot. Let's go ahead and make a way towards the front. This is a dual entry restroom. So you come in from the living area, come in from the bedroom. Just great to ensure everyone's privacy and comfort. We have our backlit mirror. Opens up to make a medicine cabinet. Backsplash, sink. We have our stand-up shower. Foot to flush toilet. And hooks to hang your towels. Behind me, I'm this wardrobe slide. So this wardrobe slide um, not only does it create more space in the bedroom, but it also creates more space for us to go through here. You'll see that we have hanging wardrobe. There's some built-in drawers, outlets here. There's a good amount of space to walk around the bed, thanks in part to this wardrobe slide. We have some more storage space on either side of the bed. And we have outlets over here and USB ports and outlets over there. There's an AC here just for the bedroom. And we have TV hookup here as well. I hope you've enjoyed the tour of this 2021 Eagle rear bunkhouse. See this camper and more online at zoomersrv.com. Thank you.